Welcome to our next video. We are filming this at the very end of our day because we need to warn you about lighting effects and strobe effects in this video. Yeah, we've come to see Fantasmic at Hollywood Studio. Enjoy the video. So we're at uh, the Droid Depot in Galaxy's Edge. We've got a bag that we saw at Lakeland Antique Mall and it's $60 before tax. How much was it there? I can't remember, yeah, look at the video. I think it might have been about <laughs> 35, 40. So you're still saving about 20 less than that. Yeah, they were in really good condition as well. Did you say it was a 40 minute wait? Yeah. Yeah, 40 minute wait for Aerosmith. So we just got off the Aerosmith rock and roller coaster. That was amazing. Yeah, brilliant. It was really fast, really smooth. Because before in the past we've done it, it used to be a headbanger. Yeah, so I always on this ride, I've got a piercing here, a bargain through me here. And I always used to smash that against the headrest. So every time I've come off that, he used to always kill my ear, like that's how I remember being yeah. a headbanger. It's been shut for a while because it's just been retracked, hasn't it? Yeah, and that's what's made it super smooth, yeah. isn't it now? Yeah, it's brilliant now. The speed, we were sat first row and that was so fast on the first row because normally on a roller coaster it's slower at the front than it is on the back. So I'd like to go on it again, but yeah. sit at the back, see how fast it is. And it, and it. As we walk past the, the carriage, it's had all new carriages as well, hasn't it? Yeah, brand so new. Everything looks brand yeah. new. It was great. But that, that retracking, what they've done, it's like transformed the ride. Yeah. It's just, it, it's literally silky smooth, isn't it now? It is, and we were on the and front. Just, and so much faster. Yeah, we were on the front, so we're hoping to get back on it again later. Yeah. And get the, the back seat. So a few hours have passed now, since we're at the Tower of Terror earlier, we decided to have a break from the park, went to got some food from Miller's, and we've now come back. It went to our condo for a bit of a break and a cool down. It was really nice to cool down away from the park for a bit. So now we've come back to Hollywood Studio because you can re-access the parking for free when you've already paid for it that day. And we're going to go and watch Fantasmic. Going back.
Close point mark again. Disney's Winter Summerland Miniature Golf because last time I was here we did the Summerland golf course but we haven't done the winter one yet so we wanted to make sure we came back and did the other golf course and also see these ornaments on this garland that is where all the ornaments come from in the Lakeland Antique Mall shop that we went to Matt, that, that's where all the um, ornaments are from I think it's just any garland, yeah. isn't it? I think they just get through them and, and that's why the antique mall gets so many, but yeah. The trouble is they're all dirty at the antique mall, so you don't really want to put them up on your tree. <laughs> Once you give them a good scrub. Yeah, they'll be alright then. So there's the opening times for this golf course, but it is included in your Disney ticket, your 14-day Disney ticket, but as long as you come before four o'clock. You get one round per day. Yeah. Per person. So we've already played the summer course, so now we've got to play the winter course this time. And then here's all the other garlands on this building where all the ornaments are from and these reefs. So these reefs yeah, are so here. all these ornaments will eventually end up in that Lakeland like antique mall yeah. that we went to. Serpents, um... I think that's so cool though that you can get an ornament. Yeah. From here, you know. Every time we come, we'll have a look and, and see if there's anything. We didn't new find anything yet. this time, did we? No, but I'm in sure the we in the antique mall. Right. So if you didn't watch our last video where we played mini golf, me and Matt actually drew in the end, we didn't did, we? In the end. So, so this, this one's the yeah. So this is the ultimate decider. Who's better at mini golf, me or Matt? Put your prediction in the comments below. It's always a close competition whenever we play against each other, so we never really know beforehand who's going to win. So, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, good, it's good fun. And we're very competitive. Yeah. So, it's the start of the winter one. Obviously, we're not, we're not going to film every hole. We'll just show you the cool courses, what they have over here. So, Lowell's not had the best of starts on the I'm first not hole. Start. First one was fine. That first one's quite difficult, isn't it? It is, yeah, if it's you don't get it. Terrible. If you don't get it in the caravan, up the ramp in the caravan, yeah, it's quite difficult to recover. Oh, God, oh dear, oh though. dear. Oh! Oh, dear. Is that four? <laughs> I like this one. It's like a campfire, you know. So you have to go through the middle. I wonder if it does something as well. Oh, look. Again in the middle. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Too hard. Have another go. Oh, yeah, that's cool. Smoking. We're on the final three holes. We're inside the house now. <laughs> This one stands a lot in chimney. I think this course has got more animatronics, haven't it? Yeah, a lot more, I think. Like moving animatronics. Yeah. Wait for Santa's feet to lift up, otherwise it's going to stop your ball. Oh, yeah, it's got a good You're a lot closer than me. <laughs> this one looks on the inside. Oh 
Hold on. Thank you. Final two. This was a cool one. <laughs> it made my jump. Mickey Jack in the box. Okay, we've just finished and Matt's adding up the scores. So one of us got 47 and the other got 49. So the winner... So the, short, the lowest number wins, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. So the winner overall is Lob. <laughs> Almost turned the event. I had a shocker on one of the... Uh, <laughs> One of the old. I said that yeah. part way around. I can't remember if I filmed it or you not. You did, you said. I said, I need you to really mess up on one. I, I need did. to do really well. We need yeah. to catch up. And that's what happened. So, yeah, that was the overall winner. So, there we have it. There's our scores 47 and 49. And if you guessed that I won in the comments, well done. <laughs> <laughs> we highly recommend you come here and do the mini golf if you've got the Disney tickets that the mini golf's included with. Um, it's right next to Blizzard Beach, so Blizzard Beach is just there. And then Disney have also got another mini golf that is right next to the Swan and Dolphin called Fantasia Gardens. So it's another one that we've never done. So we'll definitely do that next time, won't we? Next time, yeah, definitely. Okay, so what we have here is a selection of American snacks that me and Matt have never ever tried. And this little bit of the video, I'm going to each take it in turns to pick something thin, right, okay. and then we're both going to try it. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, sounds good. Are you going to the first pick then? So I think the first thing I'm going to pick, I'm going to go for the sweets. Oh, right, okay. Because I feel like if I pick chocolate, then these are just going to taste like chocolate. So right, okay. I'm going to go, I'm going to pick these first. All right, okay. We'll these. Yeah. Don't you think these are like something of Willy Wonka? They do, yeah. Don't um, they? The they look very different. They're running gobstoppers, is it? Yeah. Yeah. That's exactly what it looks like. See how big they are as well. Yeah. I mean, they're not big, big on the packaging. It's a big box, but I think we might be surprised how little they actually are. Mm. Oh, okay. I mean, oh, I mean. Oh, okay. It's pretty not, small. Yeah. Oh. What are you? That face means. A bit sour at first. Are they? Yeah. I want to eat it. I'm more. It says tangy and crunchy mm. on the box, but the inside's sweet and gummy. Okay. Oh dear. You don't like, you're a big fan of them. I like the first taste, yeah. the sourness, then to me it just tastes like perfume. Oh. Like floral really? perfume. Oh, yeah. Dear. I don't like that. Okay, let me try one of them then. You get a few in the bag, don't you? Yeah. To me, they taste better when you first start eating it. So what do you mean about the perfume, in Ash? Isn't it? It's like literally you spray a bottle of perfume, raw perfume yeah. in my mouth. But then it's sweet. I, I think they're all right. And then, no, I, I could eat the rest of them. I won't be doing, so they're all yours. Along your lines of thinking, I think we'll go with the sweets first. So probably this autumn mix. Oh, well, we've got this because it's candy corn. Yeah, we've never had candy corn. I think corn we before. filmed it. I can't remember if we filmed this in part of the video when we was in Walmart. I really can't remember. But we picked this because it's full of candy corn. We've never and tried. we've never tried it, have no. we? There's little, I'm, I'm looking forward to the little pumpkins more than anything. Well, there's a couple of different versions of candy corn. There's one that's brown at the bottom and one that's yellow. So we're doing the candy corn first. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're hard. Oh. <laughs> it's not all you expected. So I was expecting like a gummy, like a chewy gummy. These are like an ice then. Oh, are they? Oh, but well, I'm not even like I, that either. I love ice in, <laughs> but yeah, so. Are they all different flavours? No. There's like an icing inside. I don't think you're going to be a big fan of these, to be fair. That's the sound of it now. Oh, I don't like the smell of the bag. <laughs> no, 
remember what I thought. You tried pumpkin? Um, I don't understand what the hype is about them. <laughs> well, here's why we bought them to try, because in Disney, we the, the, merch, range, the merch is full they? of it. Yeah. So it was like, well, there must be something good. <laughs> I didn't think you were. I don't like my mother. Oh dear. No. I'm doing well out of this video. I'm going to have lots to eat after this. It's your turn to pick something once you've got the taste of that out of your mouth. First of all, I need to tell you about this amazing McDonald's deal that's been on, oh, it's, yeah, that's been on whilst out, yeah. we've been here. Yeah. So outside of McDonald's is advertising this special offer. It's $5 for a meal deal. And in the $5, you get a large drink you choose either a McDouble or a chicken sandwich. Yep. You get a small fries and a box of four chicken nuggets for five dollars. And a dip. And a dip. Because it's with your chicken nuggets. Yeah, pick your favourite. Five dollars. It. It's yeah. amazing, isn't it? Brilliant, yeah. So we've, we've had a few we've of had them. It, we've had it a few out, times yeah. and it's proper it's filled us up, done us, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah, it's it's really nice and it's it's a Really cheap meal to be fair when you're on the go. Max, we went there earlier on, didn't we? Yeah, yeah, stopped off something of quick. Right. What are you going to pick now then? I'm going to pick one of these pies, I think. Oh, okay. I'm going to go with. So you've got pumpkin pie, sweet potato pie, and chocolate cream pie. I'm going to pumpkin pie. Okay. Me and Matt have never, ever tried anything pumpkin flavoured. No. We wouldn't even know what pumpkin tastes like. So. Well, this holiday, part of this bit of the video, I'm going to do it. Oh, it smells quite cinnamony. Oh, you're a big cinnamon fan as well, aren't you? Mm. So. Right, it's a big bit to try. Yeah, it smells right. It just tastes cinnamony. Yeah? I like that. Can you taste any pumpkin at all? To me, it just tastes like cinnamon. Oh. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I still don't know what pumpkin tastes like. <laughs> okay, right, I'll have a go. Just maybe taste that cinnamon. All right, okay. Let me let me try it. See what That's very really nice. All I'm getting is cinnamon. It's really nice though. I think we're gonna go with a sweet potato pie on a similar theme. I mean, not that we've got to worry about flies out here because we're all screened in, aren't we? So they can hear them. It's a similar texture to that other pie. This says sweet potato pie made with sweet potatoes, butter, and spice. It tastes a little bit like egg custard with cinnamon in it. Oh no, I'm not going to like that either. <laughs> Let's see what you think. <laughs> That's where like the egg custardness comes from, like not much flavour, but oh. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I didn't even finish that. I spit it out. Yeah, you're not a fan of that one, are you? I, told, I didn't think you'd like it with being As soon as that went in my mouth. Do you see what I mean about it being a bit egg custardy? That is disgusting. Yeah, you don't like egg custard anyway. Okay, I do not like sweet potato pie. <laughs> okay. Right, I'm gonna mix up a bit. I'm gonna go for Ooh, something that I should enjoy. Brownie brittle. Salted caramel. Ooh. Flavor. Should like this. If you get this. This sounds and looks divine. Oh. Yeah. Mm. Looks like. Oh. Little square. Fun of that one. That's fun. Hmm. I think a lot more. Oh, think, that is really briny flavour. I think these upcoming ones you're going to really like. Really chocolate. I think the only thing you might not like mm. is the chocolate cream pie. They taste so good. They're so chocolatey. Like it literally tastes like a brownie. Do you know what it tastes like? You know when you make it brownies and you have some that spill and it goes crispy on the pan? Mm. It's like all the crispy bits. They're really good though. Mm, that's nice, that is. It's the best thing I've tried so far. Right, you go. Right, I'm going to go for the Buncha Crunch. 
bunches of crunchy milk chocolate, but it's obviously the, the brand crunch. Right. Yeah, they're nice. Um, it's like um, Maltese biscuit, like. Oh, hearties then. Uh, but a bunch of uh, smaller ones. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good description, that is. Of them. You like them? Mm. Chocolate's alright as well, isn't it? It's, it's, I think these are milk chocolate. It's crunchy Nestle. Tastes like Nestle. Okay, I'm gonna go for. I put these up in Walmart. They sound delicious. Nutty Buddy wafers with peanut butter. Bloody hell! Is that one? Oh, it's two. Oh, right. <laughs> I thought that was one. Oh, one bar. Wow. It's two. Okay. Two fingers. I'll say it for now. I literally thought that was one of them. <laughs> I suppose it's one serving. They're in individually wrapped. Well, they don't notice that part here. Alright. Oh dear. I'll get them inside oh dear. Mmm. Is it like a Tunnock's bar? Caramel wafer? Exactly what I said. It tastes exactly like Tunnock's caramel wafer with peanut butter in the middle. Wow. Mmm. I can smell it. It smells exactly like a Tunnock's bar. Mmm. They're nice though. Definitely got peanut butter in. Strong peanut butter flavour. I think I'm going to go for the chocolate cream pie so that we can finish on some that I think Lowell's actually going to like because I don't think you're going to like this one. <laughs> we'll see. This video is making it like I'm a fussy eater, but I'm really not. No, am no, I? it's just. I just. We didn't I have hate, a clue what to expect with some of these. I hate anything to do with cream. Pouring, whipped, squirty, anything cream flavoured. Can't stand it. Yeah, like egg custard. I hate egg custard. Yeah. All right, okay. Oh, that was chocolate, chocolate mousse inside. That's really odd. With you tasting it, it doesn't taste anywhere near as chocolatey as what it looks. Yeah, I wouldn't be bothered about this one. There's definitely better flavours to pick of these pies. There's cherry, apple pie, all sorts of other flavours. All sorts of flavours, isn't there? Pecan. Yeah, that I would normally go for. And yeah, definitely. I don't think I'll pick this one again in a hurry. It's a bit too creamy. <laughs> creamy? That creamy chocolate. Alright, oh, okay. So I just washed down my bottle of beer that match has been and got me. I've got to go to work because I want to go to Epcot for the show. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to catch the fireworks at nine. So tonight, after this, we're going straight to Epcot for the Luminous show and also to finish off recording our Epcot food and wine video. So by the time this video goes out, you'd yeah. have already seen it. Yeah. So this is the night we're doing it, is we're tagging on. Epcot to finish off the Food and Wine Festival. That's it. Yeah. So it's in one video. I've got down this beer, so. Yeah. I'm sure I will. We've got half an hour to go. <laughs> you actually picked the birthday cake ones. Because they, they were different. Yeah, but. Might be a little bit. You normally love birthday cake stuff, but these might be a little bit too creamy. Oh, it's like a moon pie. Oh, oh that might change oh, things, though. Oh, just smell like birthday cake. Oh, okay. It's quite squidgy. Oh. Oh, hang on. Hang on. <laughs> just not bad. Yeah? You, would you pick them again, though? I thought they was way creamier than what I thought. It's like it's, bas in the middle? it's basically like a moon pie. Oh, it's not too bad. Right, okay. Yeah, the box makes it look a lot thicker than mm. what it actually is. Yeah. Take a look at the box. Yeah, I think that would have been too much cream for you for mm. a lot of that, but... It's just a sliver. Yeah. You like moon pies. I'm actually going to try mine because I can't eat all that after having all this stuff. <laughs> <clears throat> it's not going to be full over the next few days, finishing all these off that you don't like. We should have bought all this and done this a lot earlier on in the video. In fact, well, we have actually had it for a little while, haven't we? We've just yeah. not had a chance to do this part of the video. Do you think it tastes like a moon pie? Yeah. It? it tastes like a vanilla moon pie. Hint at birthday cake, but I'm, I'm not fussed about these, to be fair. We'll have the brownies next. I think you might like them a lot more. <laughs> and the last two things. So these are cosmic brownies. So these are made by Little Debbie as well. Oh, 
just like your little they're cute. pack of two lot. Oh, is that a two pack, is That's it? That's two. They are split it. That's perfect then. I can already tell these look nice. You know what these remind me of straight away? Reminds me of the Caesars brownies. Yes, that, that, that's what I thought brown when I saw them on the box. Like the little the square. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Is that what, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it looks like mm. a similar texture. Do you know if you warm these up? All right. And a bit of icing sugar. Caesars. Yeah. Caesars right. brown is for definite. Right, yeah. They're nice. It's got like a fudge icing on top. They're like a stodgy brownie, they're nice, mm. they're like a moist, they're really nice. Last but not least, milk duds, candy made with chocolate and caramel. Oh, these are a good size. They're like minstrels. Are they? They look chewy though. Mm. They're chewy. What's the matter then? I've got to open it I've got. Mm. Oh dear. What's, what's, what's your thoughts on these? I've oh, stuck in my teeth. Oh dear. Oh, I mean, not bother about them. Okay. So, out of all this, like, what did you actually like? Me. Very nice. Yeah. The brown is. You got a Ooh, um, oh, and my favourite. Yeah. That. They're really your favourite out mm. of all this. Wow. I have all that, them favourite. They were from Dollar Tree as well, weren't they? Yeah. they were really cheap. Probably the cheapest thing here. Yeah. Okay. That's where it's at, everybody. Get them from Dollar Tree. So my least favourite thing has got to be the sweet potato pie. I literally had to spit it out off camera. It was so disgusting. Followed by, closely followed by them. They are absolutely rank. I would recommend trying some of these yourself though and make your own opinion because some stuff we don't like anyway. Oh yeah, it's all each to our own. It's, you know, it's mine and Matt's opinion. Because they're really what. popular over here, some of it, like pumpkin pie and yeah. sweet potato pie. So, so yeah, it's mine and Matt's opinion of what yeah. we like and don't like. But yeah, you might like it. Uh, and they're really cheap, the pies in Walmart, aren't they? I'll tell you what my favourite thing is, this beer. <laughs> <laughs> Your favourite thing and least favourite thing, go. My favourite thing was probably the brownies, to be fair. Um, least favourite, probably the sweet potato pie, because it didn't really taste of anything. It did, it was disgusting. If there's anything we should try on our next trip, let us know in the comments below and we'll try it next time. Right, so we are on our way to Epcot to film the rest of our food and wine video and also the nighttime show which if you've watched all our videos you would have already seen by now right we end this video here I want to say thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next video bye bye